Hi folks, welcome to or welcome back to Jules voiceover. I know it has been a while. I am working on things, I promise. But I saw this. It's the Colourpop Alice in Wonderland collection. Is it out yet already? Oh, it is. It's. Oh, I see. You can buy it already. Um, I'm just so drawn to this because I did a book with Stevie B. I narrated it. He wrote it called Alice. And there's just, I just, there's like, they've got a little mushroom that's a lip mask, which is dead cool. They've got, is it on here? They've got all these little, and I want, I'd keep all the boxes as well, because just look. Is it not on here? Where's the thing? They had a, a pocket watch. It's a pocket watch. Well, it looks like a pocket watch. And it's compact mirror and a hairbrush. And it's like the attention to detail. It's just so cute. So they made these pictures really small. So the the names on the um, eyeshadow palette as well are dead cute. Because I was just watching Lauren May Beauty um, swatch everything. And it's like, oh, how sweet is that? We've got down the rabbit hole. I'm late. Very merry on birthday. That's logic. Curiouser and curiouser. Talking flowers. It was the talking flowers that got to me because I remember recording that bit of the book so well with all the different pap papier-mâché flowers. It's weird. Uh, Mad tea party. Now, that reminds me of when I worked at the Waldorf Hotel and... In the Palm Court, there was the afternoon tea dances. And then we got a new manager who was an ass. But the one thing he did do, right, he said, I think it was for Easter or something. He said, we'll have a Mad Hatter's tea party. And he dressed up as a Mad Hatter. And we were, it was really cool. So that brings back happy memories. Stark Raving Mad, that's me. That way, A-E-I-O-U, nothing's impossible and lose something. But it's just like, I have to. I got um, Stevie to sign the book and send me a copy because what I wanted to do was um, what I wanted to do to begin with was I saw this uh, like charm bracelet thing and this girl made little books to hang off the charm bracelet and I contacted her and I said if I sent her uh, a screenshot of the the front of the book and she said no she couldn't do that she was only doing books that she knew and I thought how cute would that be to have um, a little charm bracelet with all the books I narrated hanging off it so then in the end I got um, Stevie B to send me a signed copy of Alice I've got a signed copy of uh, Little Lamb Lost and that's what I'm going to try and do as I move on if I do any narrating for anybody is ask them, can I have a copy of the book? But I am so drawn to this collection. It's like their silence with the, the Queen of Hearts. And then it says off with their heads, I think, inside. Let's have a look, see what it says in there. Yeah, off with their heads. It's like, it's just little things like that and it's like it's got memories for everybody because kids growing up in america watching disney watching all those type of things and growing up with alice in wonderland and it's like i never i've never watched alice in wonderland obviously you know quotes from it because it's one of those things isn't it but my connection with it now is I got the Alice in Wonderland stuff from Urban Decay years ago, but this connects to doing that book. And it's just like, it's just happy memories, isn't it? Anyway, where's that? I wanted to show you the. Um... Let me see if I can. Would it be under Pocket Watch? Nope. What if I put hairbrush? Where is it? That's just weird. They can't have the whole thing there and not have... 
Oh, they've got sale on other Disney things. I never got the Muppets one, but I was so tempted. Don't those colours just make you happy? Anyway, there is a pocket watch. Hang on. What the, if I... the Gossip Bakery. Oops. Anyway, that was... Uh, oh. Keep going to say... That's the wrong one. Right. Go back and I'll show you. Let me turn the sound off. Do you know, if I had a brain... Is it there? Right, that's the little lip mask thing, the mushroom. She said it smells like birthday cake, but look at that. She says it feels cheap, but it's like, what do you expect as part of a, a thing? Do you know what I mean? It's not going to be the best quality, but it's cute. So, if you haven't seen it, now you've seen it. Are you going to be getting anything from that collection? Just curious. Curiouser and curiouser. <laughs> Catch you later.